The fires in Australia have been burning for, some of them have been, been burning for months. There's been uh, 100 to 200 fires burning at any given time in two states, Victoria, New South Wales, uh, pretty much constantly for the past couple of months. Some of them sparked by lightning, some of them sparked by inadvertently by people, some of them intentionally by people. Um, but this is really due to the country having the driest year on record, the hottest year on record. Hardly any rainfall uh, when they should have had rain. Bushfire seasons happen in Australia. It's part of their climate, it's part of their natural environment. Similarly to how uh, the Western US uh, often deals with wildfires each summer. However, what's happening right now is sort of their bushfire season on steroids. The long-term effects really, this is a severely affecting Australia and Australia's iconic wildlife. We don't know exactly what the toll is on species such as the koala, but it has been burning, fire has been burning in ecosystems that don't normally see fire. We've seen fires in other uh, nature preserves, in other natural, uh, sort of the equivalent of U.S. national parks. The tourism economy uh, in especially parts of New South Wales and Victoria is taking a big hit because they're evacuating large parts of these beach towns that would be sort of equivalent to like their version of Cape Cod, their version of the Gulf Coast. Also these fires are emitting huge amounts of smoke and greenhouse gases which is going to further you know warm the planet but it's also darkening glaciers in New Zealand. It's causing poor air quality. This is a crisis that's going to continue in Australia. Unfortunately, the rainy season really doesn't start for a couple months there. So uh, hopefully the fire crews can uh, hold things back and better contain some of these blazes. It's important to note that um, the extreme heat that Australia has seen and the extremely high wildfire danger are both consistent with what uh, climate scientists say to expect uh, in Australia with climate change. It may very well be possible that the all-time heat record that Australia set and the highs in national fire danger could not have happened without man-made climate change.